Hey there, Commandos. This is Rooster here again with a fantastic edition of Pop of the Week. Woo! I guess we're doing a second one. Who knows? Maybe this really will become an annual feature. <laughs> uh, this week, uh, I looked at the shelf and I thought, what pop would I really like to show you guys? Uh, this one is an exclusive. It's not the hardest to find. I didn't have to go to New York Comic Con to get it. I found it at my local GameStop. That would be the Kitty Pride Pop from New York Comic Con last year. Uh, the cool part about this pop, uh, at least my favorite part about this pop, and the reason I definitely chose it, is because it comes with a little mini Lockheed, which I think is just fantastic because what's Kitty Pride without Lockheed? Am I right? Uh, Kitty Pride and Lockheed, that's probably, uh, Lockheed's probably my favorite pet in all the Marvel comics. Um... Uh, not my favorite, you know, super pet overall, but in Marvel Comics, uh, Lockheed is probably my very favorite. Uh, he's just, he's a little purple dragon from another planet. How cool is that? He's super smart. He works with the X-Men. He works with S.W.O.R.D. He works with, you know, the super, what is it, the Avenger pets. Uh, I can't remember what that line was called, but it was really great. And then, uh, you know, Lockjaw assembled everybody. So, yeah, it's a cool little pop. Uh, they're both bobbleheads. Uh, Kitty Pride bobbles a lot better. Uh, these mini ones, they don't really bobble very well. Um, they just make the head hole, uh, yeah, they just make it bigger, and then they kind of lock it in there so you can just kind of move his head around a little bit. Uh, they say that's a bobble. Uh, I disagree respectfully, Funko. That is not a bobble. That's just a movable head. But I'm okay with it. I'm going to allow it because I like them. I don't have a lot of these little guys. Uh, mostly you get the, uh, you see the little guys, like the keychain versions. Uh, you see them, sometimes they come with, um, you know, special edition, like big ones will come with little guys. Uh, like Kitty Pride came with Lockheed. Uh, Ant-Man comes with a little miniature Ant-Man uh, if you got the Collector Core Edition. But yeah, so it's a cool little pop. Uh, Kitty is in her classic outfit. Just nice blue and yellow spandex. Uh, Kitty Pride is, you know, one of the leaders of the X-Men right now. She's leading uh, the X-Men gold title. And, yeah, she's one of my favorite X-Men. <clears throat> um, I would put her pretty highly up there. Actually, she's got some big stuff happening in the comics right now, which is pretty cool. But you're not here for the comics, you're here for the pop. Uh, pop looks good on a shelf. I have an entire shelf dedicated to X-Men pops because there's been a fantastic amount of X-Men pops coming out recently. Uh, there's a cool Wolverine on a motorcycle from Collector Core. There's Sabretooth, Storm, Archangel. There are a lot of really good Marvel ones that came out recently. So you can put together a pretty solid X-Men team. Uh, right now, my Kitty Pride is hanging out next to a Colossus. So maybe if you're reading the comics, you'll be like, oh, that makes sense to you. Or maybe you're a fan of uh, the Age of Apocalypse. You're like, oh, yeah, Kitty Pride and, Apo and uh, Colossus. That'd be really cool to get an Age of Apocalypse variant. <laughs> but yeah, so that's the pop of the week this week. I decided to highlight Kitty Pride mostly because of Lockheed. But because Kitty Pride. Yeah. I mean, there's a little dragon. It's a purple dragon. You got to go with that. I could have just went with Lockheed as my pop of the week, and you guys would have accepted it, I hope. Cool. Um, anyway, thank you so much for watching this one, guys. Uh, I know this ones are short. Uh, they're just kind of like little palate cleansers to get you through the week. Um, if you like this video, though, please hit the like button. That's going to be the best thing that could happen. If you are watching us on YouTube, hit the subscribe button. That's going to be fantastic as well. We've got a couple of subscribers. We'd love to see more. Uh, we're getting some great feedback. So please, if you like this, you're like, I really want to tell you guys how shitty you are. Go ahead and do that. That would suck, but let us know. Maybe I can take that and improve. And uh, thank you so much, guys. You guys have a great night. And as always, this is Rooster signing out.